a live view from our CBS 4 camera in Doral, the Miami skyline looking uh, wonderful, a mix of stunning clouds, and we're also seeing a beautiful view from our Key West camera as well. Real-time Doppler radar, though, is showing us that we have some action in Broward County, so just keep uh, aware of the fact that we had a train spotter notice a water spout two miles east of Deerfield Beach over the Atlantic water, so it could be some of these cells right here, and there are some gusty showers moving across Deerfield Beach. Not seeing any lightning, however, just keep in mind the rain is rolling through Pompano Beach as well, Coral Springs, Weston, Southwest Ranches, and these showers are moving in from east to west. To also seeing some showers around I-75 near Miami Lakes and North Miami. We do have that onshore breeze right now, 6 to 12 miles an hour. Temperatures rain cooled in Broward County in the low 80s right now. In Fort Lauderdale, Pompano Beach, Southwest Ranches, where we haven't seen as much rain. It is warmer, 87 in Miami and Kendall in the upper 80s down through the Keys. It is quite messy here across the northeast, New England areas, as well as the Carolinas. And then we have a mix of wintry precipitation across the northern tier of the country where they're experiencing a taste of winter, if you will, with the uh, 20s and the 30s here. But then we're seeing the comfortable 60s and the 50s stretching from Atlanta through D.C., New York City, and Boston. 78 in Houston, 60s and 50s on uh, California. Right now, 40s in the Pacific Northwest. For us, we are going to see very warm and steamy as we head throughout the next few days as a series of cold fronts are on the way. The first one will likely just fade out to our north, so that really not bring us any big changes. For the weekend, though, Cold front number two arriving Saturday, and that means that we will be less warm, less humid, and the breeze will be picking up. And um, we are going to also see the better chance of rain on Friday into Saturday. And then cold front number three, that's the one that we've been waiting for. It is set to bring us the cooler temperatures as high pressure builds in, and it actually clears more like of that fall like feel that we've been missing with a cooler breeze and chilly temperatures at night. But for today, the high 80s. 87 degrees, very warm. You still need to crank the air conditioning and keep the umbrella close. Again, a few of these spotty showers around. Boaters winds east 10 knots, seas 2, a light chop on the base. And tonight, warm and muggy with the upper 70s and the chance for a stray shower as we head into your Wednesday, Thursday. More of the same, better rain chances Friday into Saturday. And then our second cold front will lead to temperatures being a little lower in the low 80s. By Tuesday of next week, we could see lows in the 60s, so it'll certainly feel a lot more comfortable and maybe an end to this endless summer. Ladies, back to you.